hello everyone this is konok in this video i am going to show you how to create simple facebook messenger bot with psp for this demo video i will use localhost and ngrok for testing purpose okay so you can build your messenger bot in your localhost with help of ngrok as facebook need to call webhook so you know localhost is not accessible from outside that's why uh, instead of using any server i will use ngrok okay first you can see i have created a file fb underscore webhook dot psp inside here my ht docs then facebook underscore webhook folder okay so first of all you need to variable for token okay verify token my verify my token okay so this token will be choose by you you can take any number like this any number and character also now when facebook will call your webhook facebook will send some data as get parameter so first time when you verify your webhook you need to verify that you accept this data and uh, print it correctly okay facebook will send a challenge variable that will be stored inside challenge data okay half challenge half underscore challenge okay then a verify token verify token okay verify token this is underscore hub underscore verify underscore token okay then you need to compare with this verified token and your token if it is mass then you will be sure that facebook send this webhook data okay if my verified token triple equal to you should use identical operator for this comparison as a, it is a security concern okay then if verify token then echo challenge then just exit okay this is uh, this code is needed to verify your webhook when you will add your webhook url okay now go to facebook app you need to create a facebook app to create your messenger bot okay now click on create app my test app for demo okay then click on create app id then i have not a robot then click on submit okay first messenger setup click on setup messenger then go to product again you need to find out webhook then click on setup button sorry webhook setup go to product then click on webhook setup for my book you need to set page now click on subscribe to this object but you need to call put uh, call back here you can see uh, this is actually inside localhost so localhost can be accessed from our outside in this purpose i will use ngrok just download ngrok from their official site ngrok.com 
okay download then download for windows and then save it okay it's downloading let it be okay download completed okay this is exe file just cut it and remove it your desktop to easy access okay now open command prompt cd desktop cd ng rock okay ng rock ng rock then you need to write http and then port is 80 okay when you uh, enter you will get forwarding url just uh, copy this url just right click it will be copied and check here okay my file is under facebook okay let's see localhost facebook facebook we hope PSP. this is the file so uh, here you can see error message but don't worry as this index is uh, not set so this is a, a notice uh, so it's not a matter just copy this and put it here okay okay the same page the same thing now copy this url and go to your app put it callback url now you need to put verify token that you have chose verify token okay now click on verify and save button okay nice this is successful okay great now go to messenger then go to settings forum here first you need to add facebook page you can uh, do this with various method but in this uh, video i will just uh, import my account from here okay you can create your own login flow with uh, facebook uh, login uh, flow and accept or get the token of pages but in this case video i am just clicking here then this is my page zero chat then click on next then done okay okay <coughs> now here you can see under webhooks add subscription you need to add some subscription field there are a lot of subscription field so whenever any message come to your page facebook will send a uh, webhook call to your server okay so i am selecting message and you can see other option like facebook messaging pushback messaging opt-ins message deliveries message reads and some other option okay now click on save button and i am generating access token from here just copy it okay now i will need this access token so i am taking a variable access token okay okay now <clears throat> whenever anyone give message to your facebook page here okay facebook will send a webhook call in your uh, webhook url so you need to capture it okay so let me show you how to capture it response equal to file get contents psp slash slash input okay like this so let me check so just for checking purpose just that it is coming fine file put content okay 
test dot txt file and just write this response that it is working or not okay here is my directory a, a file should be created here let's see hi and check here okay the file is here so this is fine absolutely fine that's great now come to here i'm just sorry now response is a json you need to decode it json decode with response true true means it will return um, array instead of object okay so now message is equal to response you can see the message is actually high here okay text high so inside sorry entry then zero messaging then message then text okay now just uh, capture the message what the sender um, write in your messenger so now reply or send message with your page you need to follow some rule here you can see this is a uh, documentation from facebook this is the url you need to send post uh, call we will use url but or call to uh, send post request to this method to this url okay and here is the example of request and this is a json that you need to post as data okay i am just copying it and putting it here reply message equal to like this okay now you can see message type it's actually message type response okay then recipient id psi id you need to put psi id here you can see the sender id this is the sender id this id is actually called psi id then put it here and test message hi thanks for your message you have right hi like this okay now to send message uh, i have already created a, a function this is a very simple function just copy it in here copy in here and you can see okay remove the public actually this is a function normal function not inside class now you can see i will pass access token and deploy message and it will call this url with url okay then send call this function you need to first provide access token okay then reply message okay now check how it is working hi no not replying oops i have made a mistake i didn't give comma let's check again okay hi thanks for your message you have right hi so you can see bot is working fine this is uh, easy to create your first messenger bot okay let's see i will give another reply like this if message equal to hi
copy in here. If message on to hello. like this okay just test purpose okay hi thanks for your message you have right hello so this is how can you can create uh, simple facebook messenger bot with psp this is easy um, you also avoid ngrok um, if you use your own server okay or hosting uh, that is publicly accessible and build your own facebook messenger board so thank you if you need any help uh, comment in the video or comment area i will try my best to uh, reply you thank you see you in the next video